What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Trade Mode James back with another Microvision price action video. In this video, we're going to talk about the close today uh, and what that means for next week. All right, before I do that, make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe button, and turn that notification bell on. All right, let's get it. All right, so we're going to start on a one hour time frame. All right, as you can see here, guys, on this move, uh, on this right shoulder, we have not had a retracement yet okay so if i pull a fib from here to here uh golden zone will put us back down around 375 right i don't think it's gonna happen i really don't and the reason is because we have this huge nasty daily bullish setup here inverted head and shoulders all right the neckline on the left side comes down to about 283 the head comes down to 250 and the right shoulder comes down to about 308 the neckline goes from about four dollars to about 410 all right we broke that 410 with some nice momentum we dropped down to a one hour you guys can see we came up today to about 438 almost 440 that was a nasty rip early this morning uh that was awesome uh we came down for a golden zone retracement all right about 50 percent on this move all right and we bounced off right here on this candle and came back up, came back up to about 425. Then for the rest of the day, we kind of had, you know, just, you know, bearish movement back down to the golden zone for a double test and a double rejection, too. So this candle uh, did not close in the golden zone and this one did not either. We closed back outside the last 15 minutes of the day with some really, really huge volume. All right. This is a nasty candle. And uh, I think. I think people are getting ready for next week. We probably are going to have a run next week. Just looking at the setup, okay? If I go back to like a four hour, uh, you're going to see the breakout to 438 and then the retest of this zone we broke out of uh, down to about 412. So that's typically what we want to see, all right? We want to see price break these zones, come back for a retest, and essentially find support where resistance once was, all right? And that is bullish. That's what we want to see. Now, I think this setup is so big that we're probably going to see this zone up here. This is just, you know, my opinion here. Uh, this is, don't take, I mean, take what I say with a grain of salt. I'm not a financial advisor, okay? But uh, usually, typically on these setups, when we get them on the higher time frames and we get, you know, this cookie cut. Uh, we're usually in for a really big move. Also, not to mention that four hour golden cross is coming up right here. We have a small gap between it here. It just looks so bullish, guys. The setup is absolutely beautiful. And I think, you know, if we can break above this zone again, up above 433 and come up here to this supply zone, how do I know this is a supply zone, you ask? Well, we look for aggressive selling, all right? Price retraced about 50% on this move and then had a super nasty big drop down, right? Aggressively. So that's a supply zone. We marked that zone up. Uh, we did the same thing over here with this one, okay? And so essentially, uh, we're probably gonna have some resistance here along this level. Uh, and this zone goes from 475 up to about 485-ish, something like that. 487 to, five, to I'm sorry, yeah, 480, 478 to 487 is this zone. And it just looks really good, man. I think we're gonna be testing this uh, next week. I think my, you know, my, my prediction for this stock is if we get above 433 early on next week, you're going to see 478 to 488 by next Friday. That's just my, uh, you know, opinion. Please, please, please take what I say with a grain of salt. OK, if you take a trade based off what someone says on the Internet, uh, you know, that's a risk in itself. And if you don't know that, you probably shouldn't be trading. All right. So but I have to have confirmations, right? I can't just be sitting here saying it's going to do this. It's going to do that. We have to break this zone, because if we break this zone, if you look to the left, there is a gap right here. OK, uh, and this gap goes up to about 450. So if we break the zone, we're filling the gap. If we fill the gap, we're probably coming up here to test this 475 area, the supply zone on the four hour time frame. OK, and if it doesn't happen next week, week it's probably gonna happen the week after that but i don't see us coming back down that's the thing here if we break this inner trend line here uh we might come back down to the outer trend line okay that might happen but even then that doesn't uh negate that doesn't void out this setup okay that just means we have a retracement and it's going to retrace again before doing that so i still think that this setup is super bullish everything going on with the stock is just so bullish the market is bleeding in general uh but microvision is holding up all right a lot of big orders happening today at the bell i got off stream like 20 minutes before the bell and as soon as i got off uh you guys see this you guys see this huge candle here okay i'm gonna zoom in for you guys uh you see this huge huge candle right here breaking out of this little wedge setup that we had drawn in here all right uh right out of this double double golden zone test rejected both times no candle has closed inside this golden zone after breaking it here uh at 414 
Uh, so yeah, it, it looks really good. And I think that people are setting up for this to run next week. That's the way it looks to me. All right. So everything really just looks super good. We're still respecting the trend line on the higher time frames. All right. Uh, the 50 SMA is about to cross the 200 on the, on the four hour. Uh, and that's going to take us up, you know, in and of itself, that's going to take us up. So all things put together, it really the price action on this chart is telling me that price wants to go up, all right? And I think that we're probably going to be seeing this, you know, 550 to $6 range in the in the very near future. I truly believe that just based off the price action. Not even taking into account what's happening internally with the stock, all right? So really, we're still just waiting for this to play out. There's not too much to talk about. Uh, but the potential downside, you know, if we play devil's advocate here, if we break this inner trend line and we break this zone at $4, we're probably coming back down towards the outer trend line here and that's gonna and that's gonna put us back towards this 200 sma we could come down and find support here before doing that that could happen all right but i there's just something inside of me that says that's not going to happen so i'm going to go with my gut and say we break this zone on monday and end up around 440 445 for the close on monday maybe even higher than that all right that's my prediction for monday and tuesday ish something like that early next week all right and uh like there's not much else to say okay we're just waiting for this 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 setup to come into fruition we have the breakout we have the retest we have a golden zone rejection uh and on the higher time frame uh, if we look at the daily it just looks even more bullish. We're making higher highs and higher lows, except for this one, all right? This was a lower high. But it, overall, in general, we're making higher highs, and that's what we want to be seeing uh, on the higher time frames. all right? It's really all I have for you today in this video, you guys. I wish I had more for you, but there's just not much. We need to get above 430, 433, all right? Like I said, a lot of big orders came in today right at the bell. A lot of them. If you go look at the order flow book, it's insane. Just go look at them. A lot of orders. Uh, large ones, too. About $2 million worth of orders. $1.5 million worth of orders. Right? There's a lot of a lot of orders coming in. So that's all I have for you today. Hopefully next week we can catch this move up to this $5 range. And uh, we can all be in the most of us can be in the green. Those of us that DCA down the rest of you. We are coming for you. Hold strong. All right. We'll be there shortly. I, I don't want to promise. I was going to say I promise, but probably we will be there soon all right uh make sure you like this video if you like this content you know make sure you hit the subscribe button if you're not a subscriber and uh yeah if you guys want to join my trading team please send me an email zone trading group at gmail.com uh i would love to have you guys on the team the team is growing quickly we have a lot of new people joining a lot of old people coming back so things are looking up all around all right uh that's all i have for today guys peace and love from my end have a great weekend i'll see you guys on monday on the stream peace out